the In-Out Movement screen is the ideal way to view defined groups of reservations. Once a list is generated, it can be used to access individual reservations or perform several bulk functions such as check-ins, check-outs, correspondence and more. The results are shown in the main window and there are several ways you can display the list. Use the scroll bar at the bottom of the screen to view the full set of available columns. Rearrange the columns in the order that best suits your workflow. RMS will remember the reordered columns for each user. To return the columns to their original order, click the Reset Columns button. Sort the rows by clicking on any column header. This can make searching longer lists much easier. Go directly to a reservation by clicking on the hyperlink in the Res Number field. Or go to the reservation account by clicking on the hyperlink in the Account Number field. Let's look at the ways we can build the results list. If your security profile allows you to access multiple properties, choose one property from this list or select all to see results from all of the properties to which you have access. The screen view options define the type of list you are building. I'll go through each option and what these numbers mean. At first glance, arriving and expected arrivals might seem like the same thing. Arriving refers to any reservation that has an arrival date in between the range displayed in this field, regardless of whether the reservation has been checked in or not. Expected arrivals are those with an arrival date within the specified date range, excluding those which have already checked in. Therefore, expected arrivals and checked in reservations will equal arriving. Building the in-out movement screen by expected arrivals in the afternoon and early evening provides a quick and easy way for reception staff to search for reservations as the guests arrive. When you open the in-out movement screen, the date field will default to only include today. Use the calendar to choose an alternative date or an inclusive date range. Clicking the refresh icon keeps the results on the screen up to date. Expected departures are those reservations with a departure date within the selected date range that are yet to check out. Checked out are those guests who have departed within the selected date range and departing is every reservation with a departure date within the selected date range regardless of their current status. In-house is every reservation with a current arrived status regardless of when they arrived or when they'll depart. Day use are reservations that have an arrive and departure date on the same day within the selected date range. This typically includes meeting or conference room bookings. Room type or category grouping can be used to limit the search to specific classes of accommodation. In my example, I've used category grouping to separate my budget and luxury room types. However, the way this is used is limited only by your imagination. Finally, for properties that enjoy numerous group bookings, simplify the search results by only showing group masters, or choose to show masters and the sibling reservations for the complete story. Now, let's look at what we can do with the list once we build it. In the simple but effective example, build and maintain the expected departures list in the morning and the expected arrivals list in the afternoon. As guests approach the front desk to check in or check out, you can access their reservation instantly by last name or room number. There are also several bulk functions. First, choose the reservations to which this function applies. 
check this button to select every reservation in the list or check individual reservations one at a time. Now select the function. This button will generate a registration card for every selected reservation. Check in or check out multiple reservations in a single action. Note that the buttons will only be active if an action applies. For example, the check in button is only active if you select reservations yet to arrive. Create a new reservation from this screen by selecting the Add Reservation button. Finally, send an SMS or a form letter to several reservations in one action. Some examples of how you might use this screen to your advantage include Select guests from the list of reservations who departed yesterday to send a guest satisfaction survey. Select guests who are yet to arrive today and send them a reminder text message. Print a list of late arrivals for the night porter. Or get really selective. Send a text message to everyone currently checked in, staying in luxury accommodation, about the chef's suggestions for the restaurant and one to the guest staying in budget accommodation about specials in the coffee shop. Start practicing with the in-out movement screen today to streamline front operations and increase efficiency.